Sonic the Hedgehog. You know him. I know him. You've read the title. That's the intro. Number five. Sonic RPG. Listen, I am a firm believer that you can put anything into an RPG. You know, when are we gonna see Paper Mache Sonic, or Sonic and the Thousand Year Chili Dog, Sonic and Tails Superstar Sega, Sonic and Tails Eggman's Inside Us? What? Listen, Sega, I get it. Sonic Chronicles is a game that exists, that you wanna f pretend doesn't exist. But the times have a changed. If Mario RPG can get a remake, then a Sonic RPG can exist. Make it happen, Sega. Number four. Side character spin-offs. Oh, what, you think I'm gonna say Shadow the Hedgehog 2? <laughs> Lol, no. Although, yes, you got a huge cast of characters you could work with. When are we gonna get a Silver game? Or a Blaze game? Or even a Knuckles game? You're telling me that that's not gonna work. Uh, have you seen Luigi's Mansion? I mean, hell, even Princess Peach is getting her own game again. Now, there are signs that this could happen. I mean, look at the Sonic Frontiers DLC. You get to play as Tails, Amy, and Knuckles in their own little adventure. Is it gonna be any good? I have no idea, but you have hope. Oh yeah, there was also, uh, Episode Shadow from, uh, Sonic Forces. No one remembers that. Number three. Sonic Games. Remastered. Ha! I bet you thought that this was gonna be all new stuff. Nope, it's old stuff that needs to be made new again. Now, sadly, this probably won't happen. Sonic and Friends have had a million voice actor changes, and every game from Sonic Adventure 1 to Sonic Unleashed isn't the current gang of Sonic voice actors. All these games are stuck in the past. I mean, why do you think we got Sonic Colors remastered? That game is overrated as fuck! I wish people could see the brilliance of the storybook games, or the Rush games, but we ain't ever gonna see those games again, are we, Sega? <laughs> number two, Mario and Sonic crossover. I bet you thought this was gonna be number one. Well, it's not, and no, the Olympic games don't count. I mean, like, this is the biggest crossover potential in all of gaming history. Mario and Sonic have been rivals since the 90s. I mean, yeah, Nintendo absolutely won, but come on, guys. You're telling me that this game wouldn't work. I'm sure if a real, genuine Mario and Sonic game was made, it'd make a billion dollars. Number one! Sonic, Shadow, and Silver. Only. Get the side characters out of here. I know I said bring them back earlier for number four. But get them the fuck out of here. Have them be the three hedgehog brothers that they were always meant to be. You know... They, you know, Sonic can be like, you're too slow, and then Shadow can go, damn, fourth Chaos Emerald, and then Silver can say, it's no use, and then, you know, you get a laugh, and it's a 10 out of 10 masterpiece. So there you go, that's, uh, that's five Sonic games, ideas, concepts that should exist already, that I've discussed now here with you. Alright, I'm gonna end this video with a Sonic meme I really like. Thank you. Goodbye. Goodbye.